everyone, Amy here. I haven't talked to you guys in a while because I moved and like did all kinds of crazy things. So for this video uh, this week, uh, hopefully I'll have more soon, but I'm going to talk about how I redid my office and it's kind of like a vlog style of how that went and like I made a Kanban board and all this fun stuff. So just watch it. There it goes. So here's the layout before and then Here's my cat. She gets to go when we move too, yes. She doesn't like that I moved the curtains out of the way. <laughs> but um, this is, is my main desk area and it has pretty much everything. I think it's mostly like the desk, like there's a desk and a chair and a computer. That's got to stay the same. Um, but I think the big thing is, and then I pretty sure my new place has like a blank wall beside my desk that I can use. if. I looked at everything right. And then this quarter I started a Kanban board. I started like a mini one just to like make sure I liked it before I went out and bought all the supplies. And I did. Um, I want to set it up at the new place. And what I did is I, I didn't buy like a, I didn't buy a big uh, whiteboard. Instead I got this like contact paper and I got chalk because it was black and <laughs> it matches me more. Um, and you could just, it's like a big sticker and you stick it up and it came with some chalkboard colors and stuff. And I want to make my Kanban board out of this, which I think will be fun. Um, and it's going to go probably on this wall and I actually have all three of my things right now. That's just for the view because the path. And then, you know, I got my planners here and usually their home is mostly on my desk. Usually when I have work, this one goes with me to work. And this one will start to go with me to work too. I've been doing like a every day. This is what I'm doing. And then that just lives here. Um, on this side, I have my letters for stationery and then my planner stickers and my planner paper here. And this used to be in like a big like accordion file thing that was huge. It was huge. Like I barely used it and I wanted something that was more accessible that I didn't have to like open to get to and this one it's already done. I'm gonna hang this up beside the Kanban board if everything works out good and then my yoga mat. <laughs> um, so pretty much this was all the same. Um, what will be different is I don't think this shelf is gonna be here because it's gonna be a closet. <laughs> so um, right before the move, I cleared out all the um, books, like the writing books I never really quite referenced because most of the stuff I look at is digital now. So um, I cleared those out and I gave them to people in my writing group. And then here are my Yakuza reference books, here are the books I need to read, and then here are my books which are so nice. So um, when we walk into the new apartment there's a big like built-in desk which probably won't get used for a desk but I think it's become like a mini shrine to me <laughs> and my books and just my writing. So these books will go there, maybe these books if there's space, but definitely these books and stuff. So that's the game plan. So just stay tuned with me and we'll see the process of me getting the stuff together. I don't know. Should we bring this cat with us? Should we bring this cat with us? Look at her. She looks so lazy. I don't think we should bring her with us. Ooh. So this is what the office looks like right now. <laughs> As you can see, it's very bare. <laughs> And here's my desk area. <laughs> um, I don't know. It was an intense two days of packing, so <laughs> for the whole house, not just for the office. So I saran wrapped the desk drawers because the doors were already organized. I didn't want to reorganize them. I'm just like saran wrap them. They're all good. <laughs> no need to move them too much. And then I have like a little jump bag that has all the stuff I need for the day of the move, which was today. <laughs> Okay, so here's the office right now. We got everything moved in. It's been about a day of full living here. And O'Hara has her spot. <laughs> and I was gonna put my Kanban board here and maybe some artwork here. I don't know, but Kanban board goes here. Uh, I have this nice little path here that will be easy and there's a window and nice. And then I move because we can't put another bookcase in here. So, 
I have a bookcase set up in here. So I have a nice handy light. And it's like this. So it has my reading books. They used to be in a different room. My writing and then my to be read list. My books. And then we have research books, writing crafty books, and then my canvas with my first book on it and flowers. Yeah, so let's set up this Kanban board. So here is one, and this one is too short. <sighs> so we're still working on this. <laughs> Supposedly the next chalkboard is gonna come here but we're also getting some curtains because there's a really bad glare with these windows so that's gonna eat a little bit into my board but I think if I just make it wide enough I'm not gonna notice um progress I also hung up this <laughs> which is where I stick my planner things just for easier access I'm so happy about this because before it was kind of far away on the floor and I'm trying to get things off the floor just to make it easier to clean and vacuum um you know when it's on the floor it gets like dust and hair because i have such long hair everywhere and it just requires lots of maintenance and o'hara is extremely happy on my lap um my desk is still the same desk setup as before <laughs> oh i got a new mouse grip because the other one was a really nice teal color but it showed everything and this one might get dirty but at least I won't notice it. Um, another thing is I got another one of these step. Oh you can't see them. Um, <laughs> I got another one of these step things. I want to get another one. These are from the container store. And I got this from Amazon. Whoa! And it doesn't hold as much as I wanted it to but it's very sturdy. Like I had to use like a screwdriver to get these screws in. I felt very like grr when I was doing that. Um, and I only have like half my board up. Like I don't even have what the other things I have to do are. So oh okay so let's uh, see the progress of this slowly putting together my office. Yes. Yes. O'Hara is going to be in my office too. She likes that. Ah, so I got the second board in and seamed them all together and then what I noticed was I had a little bit extra at the top and the bottom because I mismeasured and didn't like, wasn't exact enough. <laughs> so I got this uh, border, remember, like in grade school, <laughs> at least I do, uh, how your like teacher would have like poster board borders. So I got that just from Amazon, it was super cheap. And I used a poster putty to hang them up because I didn't want to deal with like nails or staples into the wall and it hung up super easily. But I'm going to be honest, these corners, I feel like this was the best corner, but this one's probably going to get covered by a curtain. <laughs> so um, I'm going to buy some like little flowers or bows maybe to stick in the corner. And I know like that's not the whole like three month thing. But, you know, that's what it's going to be. I put my goals here. That way it's really easy for me to see and then the to doing and then the finish and then to do is huge because there's always so much to do. And I love how the finish is like, you're probably not going to get as much done. But I figured this one would be spread out more and this one would be clustered wherever. <laughs> okay, so um, on to decorative pieces. Okay, so it's been a little while, but here is the update of my Kanban board. I added these kind of decorative bows and stuff towards the end that way you couldn't tell that I couldn't get the suits to match, but that's okay. And then I have these handy boxes for things like books I should be reading and outlines I have to do. And I have this cat who follows me wherever I go. That I cannot link to Amazon, I'm sorry. <laughs> and I put stuff for like the newsletters or the letters I write and camera stuff and Dara stuff and my desk, which is pretty much the same. But I also added this writing quote that I found at Etsy. I thought it was very nice. I got it framed and a lamp because it gets really dark here and if I'm handwriting stuff, it was kind of hard to see. So that is the final update on my Kanban board. I admit, um, right now, a few days ago, I was looking, I'm like, well, look at all the stuff I finished. 
Um, so that was really um, happy, especially because I, I make these really close together, and then up here I kind of spread them apart so I could see what I'm supposed to be doing. <laughs> um, but yeah, I also did buy um, uh, different chalk markers, and that was nice because then, like, next quarter I'm going to erase these and, like, the pink that corresponds to the pink post-it notes will be pink and the blue would be blue and the yellow would be yellow. I got, like, the chalkboard came with, like, normal chalk, but those smear, as you can see. <laughs> so, um, next quarter I'm, I have the chalkboard marker. So that's what I would suggest too, but I like it. It's black. It matches my aesthetic quite well. <laughs> and that was my Kanban board. I know it's very uh, writerly and stuff, but that's fun. Wanna, wanna say goodbye, O'Hara? Can you say goodbye to everybody? Can you tell them to get my book? No. See, she's not a good marketer. Yes, they should all get copies of my book and they should sign up for my free newsletter story. It comes out on the first day of every month at amytasukata slash free stuff. Yes. Okay. Bye, guys.